I'm Sean Gann, and this is Minute Math. And today, we're going to learn about evaluating functions. We're going to evaluate each function. So, if I was given this function, p of a is equal to negative 4 to, uh, to the 3a power, and we want to find p of negative I'm going to find p of negative 1. Well, <clears throat> every single time I see an a, I need to plug in a negative 1. So we have p of negative 1 right here is equal to negative 4 times 3 to the negative 1 power. Okay, or 4 to the power of 3 times negative 1. Better way of saying it. So now let's simplify that. 3 times negative 1 is a negative 3. So we have p negative 1. And we need to deal with the exponent first. Negative 4 times a negative 3 up there. Okay, so now here's where it gets tricky. Okay, we know a negative 3 exponent can rearrange this. We're going to keep it as a positive exponent. So we have p of negative 1. It's the same thing as the negative that's out here, we're going to leave it up top, negative 1 over 4 to the positive third power. And what that allows me to do, so again, let's see that actually. 4 to the, or negative 4 to the negative third power, the same thing as negative 1 over 4 to the positive third power. And then negative 1 can be like out front too. It really doesn't matter here. But anyway, simplify that. P of negative 1 is equal to, so the negative out front, 1 over. Now 4 to the third power. Okay, what's 4 to the third power? Well, 4 to the third power is 4 times 4 is 16, and 16 times 4 is 64. So it's 64 right there. So our final answer here it's just p of negative 1 is equal to negative 1 over 64. So let's recap. We're given p of a is equal to negative 4 times 3a, and we had to find p of negative 1. We plug in negative 1 for every single a value here, or it's only one of them, so we have negative 4 to the power of 3 times negative 1. 3 times negative 1 was negative 3. And since we had a negative exponent, I put it into the denominator and make it a positive exponent. So we had 1 over, or negative 1 over 4 to the positive third power. 4 to the positive third power is 64. So our final answer here is p of negative 1 is equal to negative 1 over 64.